The Library of Parliament is, is an organization of about 350 people and then some seasonal staff. Um, our purpose uh, at the Library of Parliament is really as a research branch to the Parliament of Canada. Our, our research will, will range from uh, science and technology to legal or law uh, to, to social affairs to um, economic um, activity. The primary users are the research analysts who provide research services to parliamentarians in Canada. Um, they work for individual parliamentarians and they provide all the research services to the parliamentary committees. Um, they work on very tight deadlines and schedules. Sometimes they're only given maybe a day or two to create and write briefing notes and background papers for the parliamentarians. So um, they need access to reference material, but they also need something that works and works quickly for them. In the past, uh, the, the process was a very manual one to, to uh, uh, take a request from a, a member of parliament, senator or a committee, and uh, come up with the research response. Everything was manual in terms of the intake, the, the question coming in. Uh, it was then handed off, literally handed off in a docket or a, a folder to the next person within the library. And you can imagine the, the, the challenges that were involved in tracking manual type documentation in an organization of 350 people. And of course, you never knew with any precision where, at what stage or step the, the request uh, was at. So, so we built something that, that really streamlined the whole process and lets, lets, lets them um, focus on their specialization in the library and less about the actual tool and the process itself. We've automated what used to be a completely manual solution to something that is now completely automated. That gives us visibility to every piece of work in the library, every document that's created. Um, and, and second of all, it also provides us with metrics. So managers now have insight to see or track where everything is. They can look at bottlenecks, they can easily see bottlenecks, they can easily adjust them. The main benefit is uh, the workflow. So the fact that their work is managed for them throughout the process. The second benefit is that they have access to the information once it's complete. It's placed in the repository in an organized fashion. Um, so they have access to it and they can search for it. We made a, a, a decision at the start of the project to, to implement a file plan, which, which is the foundation of a records management uh, um, solution. We apply records classifications, everything gets put in its proper place with the proper classification and the end user doesn't even really know it. So we've really made it transparent to the end user. So as the workflow is going on and everyone's contributing to it, underlying all that is this records management piece that they're all contributing to. We've actually become compliant now with the Government of Canada's record management plan for 2014. Um, and, and people didn't even know they were doing it. And so I really think of us having as proven that, that there's a recipe out there for, for small, medium, and large organizations to follow. Um, and um, I, 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 we were all glad to be part of it.